Hello everybody, it's Jeffrey. I'm back here with this huge, huge bag. It's a boot Lego. It is the Avengers Tower. This bag is very heavy. Uh, the build itself has like 5,201 pieces, something like that. I'm not gonna be able to build it right here. Um, I'm going to, uh, open it, try to open it here, and pull out, pull out the bags to get a, a look at them, see what they look like. I mean, I already know what it looks like, but I'd like to see what the manual looks like. Now, this is one of the things where I'll build the figures and my wife will very graciously build the tower because she is more patient and better at it than I am. The big build I always have trouble with. It's just how it is. I've had this for a few good weeks, a few good weeks now. Get this out of here. Okay, it's in this bag. So let's see. I'm being trying to be very careful. I almost cut myself there. <laughs> trying to be careful. So I can open this without opening the inner bags. Yeah, I don't want to open myself. So let's see here. So we got a we got a well we got the book. Well it's still in another bag in the bag. Alright, well let me get this one out of here. And there goes my stupid device. Yeah, flying away. My hands cramp up and sometimes I can't grasp things as easy as I used to. So a lot of times I'll be trying to open something and my hand will cramp up and it'll just go flying out of my hand, which is just what this easy knife did. So we're getting here. Yeah, it's a, it's a big bag. Buried under all this stuff. I mean, look at this. There's another bag here. So let's see if I can start to uh, open the little bags. Little bags. My friend Spice makes fun of me for saying little bags. That's how I always refer to bags. Little bags. It's a small bag. No, oh, Mon Dieu. Some of this out of here. There we go. Well, look at this. Here's the book here. Now it's modeled like the original book. It doesn't say Lego, but it has the Stark logo. Now I believe the original one has like three books, and as you look at them, pieces of the letters start falling a little at a time. Uh, so, you've got the booklet here. So I'm just going to start pulling out these parts. You've got a big base plate, which is really flimsy, and I'll replace that, definitely. But, we've got... Oh, it looks like this might be the bag with all the superheroes in it, right at the top. So, we've just got lots of... Uh, Lots of bags. Oh man. There is a lot of bags. Oh wow. 
get rid of that. I'm gonna spread these bags out here and we can take a look. I'll change the camera angle once I put this cutting knife away so I don't hurt myself. Yeah, I, can, oh, I did cut myself a little bit. Not bad though. Let's see if I can move the camera a little bit. Let's see, whoops. There's a lot of bags here. A lot of bags, I'll just try and get a shot. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, here I am with uh, what I believe to be the bag of figures but I'm not 100% sure. I think I see some in here. Pretty apparent. Yeah, we got body parts in here. I can see Loki's uh, helmet right there. Right there. So, this would be something where I would have to unbox. Yeah, I got a bunch of arms in this bag. So it's not like it's limited one bag to a figure. It looks like uh, you're going to have to open all of this stuff and mix it up and try to sort it out to see what is what in the hut. See, we got torsos and legs here. Let's see. So we got like Captain Marvel. Or is that the vision? That's the vision. Captain America. Whatever that one is. Kamala Khan or whoever that's supposed to be. I don't know. This might be Captain Marvel. I don't know. I'd have to look in the book. It's hard to tell when you don't see everything at once. Well, there's Iron Man. Here's another Iron Man. I think that's Nick Fury. I think there's like 30, there's like 30 uh, figures, or 31 figures. So, that's Ant-Man, I recognize that. That's Black Widow. This one, I don't know. Here's another Captain America one. Whoops, right here, I'll put that next to that one. Different kind of Captain America. just got a lot of figures I'm gonna have to uh, yeah see some of these look like duplicates they're probably soldiers or bad guys or whatnot I think that might be pepper pots I don't know I want to say Ultron but I'm not sure that is definitely the Scarlet Witch's well, if I can hold it right, that is definitely the Scarlet Witch's uh, part of her body. That's going to be Thor. Now, there's a lot of different figures here. Well, that's weird. I don't even know what that is. I want to say that might be a Tony Stark chest because the T-shirt. We got a lot. Yeah, the original, the uh, the Lego version of this thing, this uh, tower. You're looking at like five hundred bucks, and there's no way I could ever justify spending five hundred dollars on a toy as much as i oh that's quicksilver right there as much as i love the toys i could never look anyone in the face and go yeah what'd you do today oh i spent five hundred dollars on a lego toy i would expect any of my friends to pound me in the throat with their fist 
if I said that. But if I say oh, I spent a hundred and sixty, which is what we did spend, I know that's pricey, but a hundred and sixty for all this stuff, I think it's a good price. You know, I do think it's a fair price. You know, it's not so out of the realm of possibilities where it's like, I am not going to spend that kind of money. But right now, just sorting these pieces, I'm getting bleary-eyed just looking at them, trying to d tell the difference between the colors. I'll need to have my wife double check my work and see that's a blue one, that don't, that's not black. Sometimes I can tell the light hits it just right and sometimes I can't. You know, it helps when you compare them to themselves. For me, you look at them by themselves, it's like, is this black or dark blue? It can be hard, because the lighting in this house has always been terrible, and it will never change. Only if somebody bought this house from us and actually uh, invested in a new lighting system. We've done what we can with what we got. And that's all you can do. Like, it is hard to tell sometimes if this is something that's black or dark blue. See, this here is dark blue. It's not black. And that one is too. It can be really hard. It, it looks like a good build. And it actually came in on time, which I am surprised. It came in in a good amount of time. I didn't have to message or babysit them or contact any authorities or anything stupid like that, which I've done in the past, unfortunately, because I've had to. But not with this. So this is... Uh, Pretty cool. What I'll do is just sort some of these things. And probably off camera I'll build a bunch of them. Just to get things underway. Underwear. <laughs> but what I will do right now is I'm going to cut the video here. And I will be back real soon to show you more. Hi, everybody. This is Deb. Um, Jeff hauled out his uh, Avengers Tower, so I figured I'd give that a start. Um, he started on some of the figures. I tried to help and sort them out a little bit because I need the table. But um, So I'm going to crack open this box. I think there's 39 individual bags, but this... This big bag here is bag one through four. So I'm going to go ahead and there's the tapes I needed for the characters. Put that right behind me. So three, three, one, one, one. One, two, three, four. That's what that says. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One little bag for two. Let me do this real quick. This has Loki's cape. Scarlet Witch's cape. If I can, Oops. Scarlet Witch is here. So goes like this. It goes on like this. Yeah, that's not gonna fit on there like they want it to. Well, you know what? I'm going to do this. Boop. 
See, Jeff does not do good with the little <laughs> capes and whatnot. Jinxie, stop crying. Down there whining for no reason. Mm. I don't have the right face for her. I don't know. Some of these are messed up. I don't understand it. Um, hair. Hair. Yeah. How can that go on there? Really? Seriously? I don't know. We're missing hairs. I don't understand because that's definitely not the right size hair. So I got her cape on anyway. Here's Loki. Let me put his cape on and get his head on. Uh, let's see. You know, straight on straight. That way I can get you. There's Loki's head. See? Loki! Woohoo! Loki's done. I don't know who the red cape belongs to, so. I don't understand the big hair there thing. I don't get it! I don't know. We're missing hair. Thank God he's got... We've got extras up the wazoo with that stuff. So, I'm going to leave that be. So, let's get into this here. I'm going to cut this over here because I don't need that yet. Uh, I have no idea. That's just a bunch of little bits and pieces. doesn't look right. It really doesn't look right. Yeah, he'll, he said he'll be in there in a little bit. He's in there resting. All these pieces Bag four. What I'm looking for. Oops. Put that plate there. Plate. Dark plates. Okay. Dark plates. Let's just toss this out just a little bit. Jinx, you need to go lay your butt down before I get angry. This I need, but Let's see, I don't have that piece. Let's just get all these open. Open up all bad ones. Four, that's three, that's three. That's a bunch of three. We just dump that out. One, two, three. Oh, come on, get out. That bag four. Two, three, four. This is all bag one. And that's three. So let's get these plates all separated. No, I think the piece I need is for it to go. Oh, I swear I saw it. Let's 
three pieces of here. Sorry if I'm going to sit here and put my hands in your face. Just trying to sort a little bit. Trying to find a piece, which is right here. And then this goes on like that. And then this goes on like this. And then I need two little gray pieces. I don't know how many of these I'm expected to have. Oh, Pepper. I really don't. Let me do this. Jinxie, go lay down. There's the other one right there. We went out today and I got the Rocket Raccoon, finally. He said I had to have it, so. What he says, I must have, I must have it, I guess. So, I got it. So, I'll build that at a later date. Just like, um, I've got all the Animal Crossing sets that came out this round. So I will do a video on those again at a later date. I gotta get these built first because he he dug this out first. So I shall do this one first for him. Why? Because I love him. Poor guy. Poor guy. I love the man. Yep. All right. So here I need one the gray. Oh, I'm still, wait a minute, I want it like this, right? Yep. So this goes here. i got to cut on my finger and I'll tell you. Sometimes it hurts when I'm pushing down on things. Alright, and then this gold goes here. And then these two go on either side. Go one and two. I done that and then that one so I'm doing this one now so this one is one two three and four so do this on top like so and then I need a two little yeah if I pay attention I'd see what I'm doing but I can't here and this one goes here so and then here I need this and so this is upside down right so I'm going this way so this ouch freaking finger that's tender tender all right switch it back over I need another one of the gold little gold bars I need two of the little black things there. Yep. One. Oh, come on. Ouch. Ooh. Oh, freaking finger. If I put a band-aid on, I'm not going to be able to pick up a darn thing, so. Suffer in silence, Deborah. Well, not silence. I'm letting everybody know when I shouldn't. And let's see. I probably won't stay recording too long, but he wanted me to start recording. So. If I record a little bit, maybe he can do a little bit more. Let me just get this first few steps down and then we'll go from there. How's that? Okay, so that's like that. And then I need one, two, three. That's like the first step right there. I think this is that dinosaur on that scene. So 
Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that, and when he comes in, I guess we'll record a little bit more. So, I guess I'll talk to you in a little bit. Bye. Hello, everybody. It's Deb again. Um, Jeff hasn't joined us yet, so, but that's okay. Um, I finished the first thing, which is the little, I can't remember what this guy was called. It's the little dragon there that the little mechs came out that attacked everybody. So, that's the dragon. All built. It's on a nice little stand. You can see that. Yeah. See? So that's it. So I will continue building for a little bit longer. And I will fill you, fill you in later. Thanks. Hello. I just wanted to show that I got the first floor pretty much done. There's the bumpers in the front. There's a rounded there on the side. Bunch of windows. And then if we turn it around, just bear with me a second. Ooh, sorry about that. This is the back side. There's the back door. And it opens and shuts. See, boop, boop. And then we turn it around. Oop, I just took the bench off. Oop, give me a second. I'm sorry about this. Giving you a seasickness. And that's the inside on the first floor. And that's it. Um, I'm going to finish today. WrestleMania Day 1. I'm going to go start supper. And call it good. Okay, before I sit down and get started, this is like really early in the morning before I start work. Um, I wanted to get some work done, so I just wanted to show off what I've done. This is the first floor that I've done. Yep. Right. Oh, that doesn't help, does it? I turned off the light. There we go. There it is. And that's the inside. You can probably see it really good down in there. That's the first floor that I've done. This is the second floor. I'm not quite done yet. But there is that. Turn it around. And there. See? You got capped shield there. There's that side. And then, whoop. I'm taking windows off. Look at that. Look at that, Deb. I'm destroying your work. There we go. And there's that. So that's all I've done on the second floor. I wanted to try to get the second floor done, mount it up there, and then start on the third floor before I start work. So let's see how I do, and um, we'll talk to you later. Okay, here she is. She's got three floors done on the Avengers Tower yep. right here. Let's take a look inside. I don't know what this scene is. I can't remember. Where the... This is the gangplank where Captain America was fighting himself. And then they fell down. And as you got them there. And he says, that's uh, America's butt. Right there. Okay. Right there. Where they're looking at each other. What He knocked himself out. Right there. And he's staring at his butt. Of course he is. Well, Chris Evans. All the women love Chris Evans. I don't... You do, too. Oh, uh, no, I don't. I love you. Yeah, so this is coming along pretty good. Yeah, I thought so. Starting on the third floor. Fourth floor? Third. One, two, yes, fourth floor. Fourth floor. Third okay. floor. Third floor. One. Oh. One, two, and that's oh. going to be three. Okay. Scratch that. Third floor. Okay. It's been forever since I've worked on this because of back issues and health issues and all that stuff. I couldn't get in here and um, between work and all that. But I'm finally working on the tower again, trying to get that set. I've put on another floor here. So we've got, if you look on this side, you can see one, two, three, four floors so far. One, two three and four and my dog is pathetic and there's the other side of it oh yeah Whoa. I'll get a better shot of this all later I'm just gonna because we're waiting for some pieces because we didn't get pieces and we got them in and now I'm working on it again so yeah a lot of things environmental issues here whether it be pieces missing health issues whatever we got it going, so I'm going to keep on working on that. I think we're up to 228 on the instructions. So I will let you go and give you an update later. Bye. 
All right, it's just me again. Just giving you a quick update of what I've been working on. That's the last floor I put on. So you get it all the way around. It's kind of a glass all the way around. Um, and then this is the next floor I'm working on. It's almost done. So that's what you got. We'll see where we get tonight. Be back in a few. Well, it looks like I'm getting ready to put on the last part of this, which is this wall here. So you can see on the inside, here's the first floor. I put Loki and Thor down there, see? And then there's Captain America on the second floor. And there's one of the mech suits. I didn't put anything in there yet because I'm not quite sure what to do. And then I got Pepper Potts and Iron Man there. And then the very top floor. I don't know what to do with that yet either. So, I don't know yet. We've got enough people and I put a couple of people out here. So we shall see. On to the next. And here we are with our finished Avengers Tower. Right here. It took a long time. It's been months since I started recording stuff for this video. I didn't set it up the way it normally is set up with the different figures the way they have it. Some of the figures I wasn't big on and quite frankly some of them since they're boot Lego, the quality of them, well some of the hair pieces didn't fit right. Well one of the hair pieces didn't fit right and uh, what not. And I had some figures I had were actually better and real figures. So I used real figures in place of the ones that were cruddy, to be honest. During the building of this set, my wife ended up having to order parts that were missing because I think we actually had a small bag that didn't show up when they packed it over in China or wherever they packed it. So I just set up a bunch of heroes outside of both buildings to have like a massive battle in the streets. And again, it doesn't follow the Avengers movie because I've got characters, you know, that are not in there, but I don't care. I'm not going to open it from the inside because you saw enough of the inside when Debbie was building it. And you can see many pictures online, but for all intents and purposes, it... It is the Avengers Tower, but it's a boot Lego. It's not, it's not real. It's not real at all. You can see the size difference. Inside the Avengers Tower, there is uh, a bunch of figures set up into position like they were in the movies. You know, different iconic scenes like Captain America fighting himself in there. Stuff like that. I think Loki's in there somewhere. But different characters are in there. And of course I wanted to have next to the Daily Bugle. But yeah. This is the finished build. You got Loki's little chariot thing here. Right there. We also got the uh, that alien vessel there for the Chintari warriors that they come out of. There's also, if I can get over here, there is a, uh, that little ship there on the landing bay and some characters doing some funny things. But this will probably be the last big set I ever buy. Because I'm starting to downsize stuff in my home. And I need to make space. So, my Lego building will probably change to smaller sets and more minifigures. Because minifigures, you can stick them in a tote and you're all set. The big sets like this, it's like, where do you put it after you build it? It's like, it's huge. So, they are very nice. But I'm also starting to get older and I need to think about things and space and where I want to be in five years. So, that's it for this. Talk to you later.